But you got the news out of the bag a little bit before this conversation, which is you've made the decision to stay on at the House Financial Services Committee and not run for leadership, as a lot of people thought you might. Talk to, talk to us about that decision. Why? Yeah, well, Punchbowl broke it. Um, so uh, thank you. Uh, or, uh, or damn you. I'm not sure. <laughs> um, but um, no, I, the, the decision... Uh, I made my second term in Congress was there are two jobs in the place that I desired. One was to be WIP, the other was to chair financial services. Um, and I'm presented with the option in, because I believe Republicans will get the majority in the House, and that's what I'm working for, uh, but presented with the option of which one do you want in the circumstance we're in. I know what the next Congress looks like in terms of legislating. It's going to be mainly an oversight function for the House of Representatives in a divided Washington. There are a few narrow opportunities for legislating. Uh, but outside of those narrow opportunities for legislating and oversight, we have two big votes. One is funding the government, and the other is raising the debt ceiling. Uh, so I realize being uh, the whip, counting votes for those two big votes, those two big initiatives, um, versus running an agenda on the Financial Services Committee. And I've had the opportunity to sit next to the ranking member, uh, as ranking members sit next to the chairman, and the chair makes the decisions on the agenda. You're basically riding shotgun, and yet you don't have any control over where you're going. Um, and so I'd like the opportunity to run an agenda, and I'm optimistic about the opportunities that we have around innovation, capital formation, and oversight that, that make it very interesting to be on the, uh, on the Financial Services Committee and to run the agenda of the committee. So given the circumstance, I'm much more optimistic about the opportunities we have at Financial Services than the role that I could play uh, in House Republican leadership.